For the molecule represented by the Lewis structure shown here, the NCN bond angle is closest to A. 180 degrees B. 109.5 degrees or C. 120 degrees A bond angle is defined by specifying three atoms. The middle atom is called the vertex of the angle. Imagine a line from the first atom to the vertex, and a line from the vertex to the second atom. For this question, our vertex is the carbon atom. It may seem obvious based on the Lewis structure that the NCN angle should be 180 degrees. In fact, though, it is not. A Lewis structure does not necessarily show the correct bond angles. A Lewis structure only needs to show how the atoms are connected and how the valence electrons are shared. Whenever you're asked for the shape, you should answer based on what the actual molecule would look like. Bond angles depend on the steric number of the atom at the vertex. The steric number refers to the number of regions of high electron density around the atom. Each region is called an electron domain. In the case of carbon, in the structure shown, the steric number is 3. Each single bond counts as one electron domain. Here we have two single bonds. A double bond counts as just one domain as well. So the carbon to oxygen double bond also counts as one domain. So the steric number for the carbon atom in the structure shown here is 3. Valence shell electron pair repulsion theory, VSEPR, says that regions of high electron density are oriented as far away from each other as possible. If there are three regions of high electron density around an atom, then these regions would be furthest from each other by being oriented 120 degrees apart. Therefore, we expect the NCN angle to be close to 120 degrees. Actually, it is slightly less than 120 degrees because the double bond repels the single bonds more strongly. The correct answer is then C. Since the three groups of electrons sticking out of the carbon atom are all on the same plane and are pointing towards the corners of a triangle, the carbon atom in this case is called a trigonal planar center. Here's a better way of showing the orientation of the electron domains around carbon. The NCN bond angle refers to the angle formed by this line and this line. 